not the America that I was raised to believe in. When we're not showing up for the people that need help the most. More than a dozen Ashland locals gathered across from the public library Wednesday night to kick off a two-day demonstration. The Housing Now group is demanding citywide changes to how the homeless are treated in Ashland. They're not going to do the right thing just because it's the right thing. They need pressure. Event organizer and former Ashland City Councilor Eric Navikas says he and the advocacy group want the city of Ashland to make changes so the homeless are not only housed but are are also protected. Um, there aren't enough beds for the homeless population, so people are forced to sleep outside and they're constantly facing harassment from the police, citations, move along orders. The group wants the Hargadine Street parking garage to become an immediate transitional housing site with long-term demands that include a luxury tax on large homes and two social workers on the police force. Yeah. Navika says the effort is part of a larger movement. So it's a big solidarity movement for the entire West Coast pushing for cities to address this crisis of homelessness. According to him, the demonstration is happening alongside similar acts in other West Coast cities like Los Angeles, Portland and Tacoma, Washington. Tacoma Housing Now tweeted Wednesday that across the country, housing groups are doing coordinated holiday actions. The group saying they won't stop until people are housed. We're going to keep going. We're going to keep ramping. We're going to keep building the momentum behind this. In Ashland, Grace Smith, NBC5 News.